This is an apartment we have available for rent in La Mata. Um, La Mata is just about five, 10 minutes from Torbea by car. And a lot of people come here because of the beaches. Um, I find the beaches here are much better than Torbea myself. Um, but also it's got a very, very village feel to the whole place. Um, this is the boardwalk. The boardwalk actually runs the full length of the beach. And you'll find there's restaurants along here um, from where we live. There's a couple of restaurants and then you continue all the way along. There's more and more restaurants as you go. It also runs up to the plaza. And in the plaza, you'll find that the restaurants actually go around the square. So there's a lot of restaurants there. There's also a pharmacy, supermarket within walking distance, the bank, uh, news agents, church. The plaza is the, the hub of the town and it's only about five minutes from the apartment. They may look a bit over secure, but the reason these apartments are grilled windows and doors is basically most of the year um, out of holiday season, these places are empty. So they have extra security purely because there is nobody there at other times of the year. So you may think, oh, this, it's a rough area. It's not a rough area. It's just simply uh, because nobody is living in these places at other times of the year. They're mainly holiday uh, cottages, uh, holiday flats. This, this um, sofa may actually be a sofa bed. I'm not 100% sure. I can't remember. But we're renting this as a two bed, uh, uh, sorry, for two people rather than a family simply because of the the amount of space inside the place. Um, you've actually got your kitchen uh, kitchen dining area here. Um, you could actually use the sofa for, for say a maximum of three people say, uh, because you could actually have somebody sleep on the sofa even if it's not a sofa bed. Uh, your TV is here, you've got a small balcony which is ideal for just having a cup of coffee in the morning or putting your laundry out to dry. As you can see, it's not a huge balcony area but it is enough uh, just for getting uh, your washing done and the uh, the morning coffee. This is the views you've got because you're not on the seafront side, you're actually on the opposite side of the town, which is the, um, the lake side. There's a huge lake over the back here. Uh, you've got all these vineyards. Um, there's cycle paths that run along here, so you can actually go cycling if you, you, you hire a bike. You can actually cycle to Guatemala, you can cycle uh, into Torbea. Uh, it's, there are cycle paths all the way around, so you can move quite quickly by bicycle. Um, also, you can cycle through the, the park um, because there's cycle paths through the park. There's also trekking paths. It's, it's mainly a reserve. There, there's no construction or anything going on here. I think it's actually down as a natural reserve, so it's, it's quite a beautiful area. This is the hallway. One single hallway uh, straight through the rooms. So, you, you know, this it's just that. <laughs> the kitchen is basic, but the whole point of uh, most of these apartments are built for people that are going to be in and out the apartment you know if you're going to be on holiday you're going to eat out most of the time you may have some laundry to do so there's a washing machine uh, but generally people eat out they normally only in the apartment for a coffee in the morning cup of tea maybe grab a snack later on during the day come back for siesta but most of the time people aren't living in the apartments they're out enjoying themselves um, there's a stove here just out of sight that's built into the worktop. You've got a fridge freezer here so you can keep your water cold, you know, so you can have some chilled water during the day. And um, there's your hot water tank. The bathroom is compact, but it has all the functionality that you need. The shower is also a bath, so you, you can have a bath or a shower. And basically that's it, you know. It, it's a small apartment designed for maximum three people, but ideally for two. It's got everything you need there. There's parking outside. The restaurants are within walking distance. The supermarkets are within walking distance. You can walk um, to the uh, tourist information office. 
Uh, there's bus routes, so you can get here from Alicante Airport. Um, you're also on the bus route for going into Torveya town, um, which is an expense. I'm not sure how much it is, but I would expect it to be about a euro each way, which is nothing. Um, there's also a car for supermarket within about 10, 15 minutes drive. Um, it's an ideal location. We live in, to we live in La Mata ourselves, so we love it here and recommend it as a place uh, to come on holiday.